feel like you're really getting set up and ready to hit the road running when your paparazzi kit arrives. So fun, you're doing great. Today we are gonna talk about setting up a Facebook page and a Facebook group. I actually have a video that talks about the difference between the two. Basically a Facebook page is going to be like a storefront and a Facebook group is going to be kind of like a club. If you're at this stage in your business, you need to have settled on a name for your business because you are going to use that name um, to set up your Facebook page. I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step step how to set up a Facebook page. This is my personal Facebook page. Up at the top kind of right-hand corner, you will see the word create. You can click on it and choose page to create a Facebook business page. You'll pick business or brand and get started. This is where you're going to enter in the name of your brand. We're gonna call it Sugar Bee Bling Tester. And then a category, um, jewelry, and then continue. This is where you can add a profile picture to your page. I would recommend uploading a profile picture of yourself because that way people can connect to you as their jewelry consultant. I'm gonna skip this for the time being. Next, you can add a cover photo. A cover photo fills the top of your page um, and you can make a custom one or you can find some that already are available and upload it into that area. I'm going to skip this as well. That's all there is to it. It goes ahead and creates that page for you. As you can see, it suggests to have you help um, invite people to like your page right when you get started. Now I'm gonna walk you through step-by-step step how to set up a Facebook group. You also may want to start a group or a club on Facebook for your business. Again, go to the top right corner, hit create, and here you're going to find group as an option. You can name your group like Sugar Bee Testers VIP. And then you can add people if you want by their name or their email address. You can decide the privacy of your group. Um, I have my groups set to public, but I also have it to where um, I have to approve all the members that come into my group. And then you hit create. Just like that, you've created your group. And again, you can pick an image to personalize your group up here and go ahead and invite friends to your group. You might be wondering how to start a page or a group from your phone. So I'm on my Facebook app. Down at the bottom, there is this little flag, and that means pages. You click on that. It'll pull up your pages, but it also gives you the option to create a page right there at the top. It's going to walk you through step-by-step step on your phone how to create a page, just as it did on a computer. You can also create a group directly from your phone. It's gonna be the circle with people in it like they are in a group. But up here at the top, it will give you the option to create a group. And again, it's going to walk you through all of those step by step. Your kit probably hasn't arrived yet, but you can still utilize your Facebook page and or group to be able to tell your friends and family that you're getting started on a new business adventure, to go ahead and like you there, and to follow the things that you have set up, and to be able to build that customer base even before your kit has even arrived. Hopefully this was helpful for you. Now go ahead, go share what you have set up, spread the word, let everyone know so you can build that customer base and get started the moment your kit arrives. Again, I'm Mandy with Sugar Bee Bling. I have other quick tutorials here on YouTube that you'll wanna check out. Feel free to subscribe. Um, I've got all that for you.